Welcome again to this Friday edition of Stevie Solves. It's Friday, May 12th, 2023, and today's puzzle is by Enrique Enestroza Anguiano. That's definitely a new name to me, so uh, I'm looking forward to what he's got in store. Usually Fridays don't have a theme, but they're really difficult. Only The only more difficult puzzles than Friday are Saturdays, of course. And before I get started, I want to get say <laughs> the most strange thing to be grateful for. You know, I always start my videos with a gratitude. Yesterday, I took def defensive driving or uh, here in Arizona, we call it traffic survival school. And my teacher was actually really cool. We got to skip over a lot of the boring parts and we took lots of breaks and went actually he answered some questions about different legal things and things we should say to police when we get in trouble and different things. And also I had a friend, someone that I knew in the class with me named Steve, this guy that I play poker with. Uh, we call him New York Steve. So we got, got to have lunch together and talk a little bit about poker and life and stuff. So that was cool. All right. Let's see. Let me share my screen. There you see it. May 12th, 2023. Enrique. Tough to see that. Enrique Enestroza Anguiano. All right. And here we go. Powdered green tea. I think that's matcha. M-A-T-C-H-A. Let's just check the crossers. Oops, see, I'm lining up. There's a clue right up here that you can't see that I want you to be able to see, even though it's already highlighted over to the side. There we go. Time to focus on oneself. Sounds like me time. But there's too many letters. I wonder what's going on there. Don't assume. Say. Don't assume. Sounds like ask. Recess retort. Are so. This is going to be ask. Like leaving the price tag on a gift. Tacky. Because I'm already thinking the T there. So this is going to be matcha. Sketching tools. I'll come back to that one. Farm fresh box letters. See, I don't know. Hmm. Well, this is an easy one across. Mistake fixer is an eraser. A me day could be a time to focus on oneself. This could be yo yo. To waver wild wildly is to yo yo. Yes. Brand whose B stands for brush. Oral B. The toothbrush team. Farm fresh box letters. I don't know that one. Transfer as wine. I believe that's decant. They rule the roost. Those would be hens. Sketching tools are art something. That makes sense. Art supplies doesn't fit. One way to start a point. I need more than that. Philosopher Girard, who coined mimetic desire. Girard. I'm not sure. It's probably a, a vowel, and it is a vowel. Louder of cosmetics. That would be este louder. Second sight. Say. Sounds like ESP. Hang on. I'm going to get rid of this bar down here. Ah, screw it. I'll just leave it for now. 
brainstorming diagram. Hmm, you've got like pros and cons. I need a little more. Appalachian Spring Hours, that would be E something T, either standard time or daylight time. Okay, can't make me, I won't. So again, in quotes, quotes always means you're looking for a replacement phrase. So when someone says, can't make me, and notice how, well, there's, a, there's never a, rep a repeating word. So if it says, if the clue says, I'm not going to do it, the answer won't say, I won't. It might say something like, make me or whatever. So there we go. Nothing else could be, is that, is that it? Doesn't drink much. Doesn't, oh, sips. <laughs> Cute. Is that it? General Sherman in Tulare County, California is the world's largest one. I'm thinking a tree. Yeah, the world's largest tree in, in California, the redwood probably. Doctor alternative. Sounds like German or something. Blue, like Bluetooth connections, they are wireless. Leonard Bernstein's Candida Operetta. I'm thinking stackers of plastic tubes. Don't know. Das something gut. I think that is good is German. Das ist gut. Analgesic with a soothing sounding name. Aleve. Remember, I'm already thinking there's an A in the top square, and since it fits and Alleve, sort of like alleviate or relieve. Little confab. Confab makes me think of like a little lie. Hmm. Is that it? Oh, stackers of plastic tubs are the TSA. When you're going through airport security, those little plastic tubs, they sit there and stack them. I'm thinking this is air, H-E-R-R, -R. one way to start a point in tennis would be a spin serve. Is this D or S? Brainstorming diagram. I'm thinking it's idea. Rene Girard or Girard Rene is this art pencils fits computer flow like insert picture from file is that like Pascal what is this oh idea map I bet that is Barb and Star go to Vista Del Mar. It's the only thing that fits, right? Cascade something. Cascade Macro. No, let's see. Best of the best. All time something. The House of Spirits novelist. Don't know that. Something minor, minor, Asia minor. As it could be Ursa minor, but that's not going to fit with a, with the A. Rock band with the 2020 Album of the Year nominee, Women in Music, Part Three. Women in Music, Part Three. I don't know that rock band. 
polite thing to call someone, sir. And then this other polite thing to call someone sounds like madam. Kind of pit could be a mosh pit. Let's just scroll down and work that corner. Brought on, when you bring on someone into the company, say you hire them. Name associated with simple explanations. Can't think of that one. Letter after fee. Maybe Kai. Baseball's something Victorino, nicknamed the Flying Hawaiian. I think it's Shane. Wrote some hip hop lyrics. Say. Could be pinned. Is this an N? Not forward. Could be aft. Daytona 500 organization. That's NASCAR. Initiation ritual. Haze. Is this a Z? This sounds like ethane. Not forward is shy. Oh, rhymed when you wrote some hip hop lyrics. Rhyming. Oh, Occam's razor. Is the one that says, uh, you know, the simplest explanation is usually the correct one. It's not always, though. Initiation ritual could be a bath, an oath, probably. That makes a lot of sense. All right. Let's see. There we go. How a lawyer might be kept on retainer. Let's see. Ah, that's annoying. It's just a little too big there. Let's make this shrink down a tad. Okay. Don't blow it. Best of the best could be all time greats. Plural. Minus could be less. A snap sounds like easy. Hmm. Don't blow it. Now notice that it's not it's not in quotes, which means we're not looking for a replacement phrase that literally means don't blow it. We're looking for something that you're not supposed to blow, like This is a cascading. This is big something. Don't blow it. You're big something. Neckwear that's not constricting, one hopes. That would be a boa. A boa with the little feathers constricting like a boa constrictor. Nice. Musician's mouthpiece. Don't know, but I think that's a G cascading something. Something candy. Best friend of Wonder Woman. Is this an agent? Musician's mouthpiece would be the agent. That is a little confusing. Good clue. Isabella Allende. House of Spirits novelist, Isabella Allende. Okay. Oh, you don't want to blow a big lead in sports, say. Air Safety Org, that would be the FAA, Federal Aviation Administration. So we got FFA and TSA in the same puzzle. Some shortcuts. Could be like a sh short haircut. 
some shortcuts don't know the blank of woo a book by rapper the rizza of the wu-tang clan let's see a cascading macro no it still doesn't fit this could be oh yes I'm gonna say this is wrong. Oh, Sant minus. <laughs> was it just one or two days ago? My puzzle word of the day was sans, which is French for without. So I should have thought of that sooner. So minus is sans. And then avec is with. Easy. Oh yeah, or oh yes, cask, oh you, oh you, cascading menu, tete a tete, a little confab, I think a confab now I think is when people get together and talk, Another, this is more French, tete is French for head, uh, of course, in Spanish, it's cabeza. In Italian, it's testa. But in French, it's tet. Tet a tet. So yeah, the Tao of Wu. That makes sense. Looking great. Subsection of an orchestra. Clarinets. Devil follower. So whenever you see a clue like follower or it comes before devil, you're thinking of a prefix or a suffix in this case. So a devil follower sounds like devilish. Rock band, I think that's hair. Women in music, be worthy of can't think of that one off the top. Cut, 19, Colt, 1990 sitcom. Set at WNYX. I think it's something radio. I think it's news radio. Is that the one where Joe Rogan got famous? Can't remember. It's hard to see through. Don't know. Let's think some more. Conduct could be wire, like like you have heat conduction, you have electrical conduction. Let's see. Let's keep thinking. Word with pinky or promise. Pinky promise is a thing. Pinky ring or promise ring. <laughs> So Will Shorts, the guy who is in charge of all these New York Times crosswords, he's the editor and helps out the puzzle makers with all the clues. He loves clues like this where he gives you two words that are related, but then there's an unrelated word that you've got to think of. So pinky ring, promise ring. What's this? Some shortcuts might be fades. Believe it or not, I did once have hair and that was my go-to hairstyle was a bald fade. So you would start out like really short and then fade into still short, but not that short. So it would be a little fade and it takes some skill on the barber. They hatch late in life. Something eggs? It's hard to see through, maybe smog. Portmanteau. Portmanteau is a word that's a combination of two words, such as smog. It's a good example of one. Uh, smoke and fog, right? So uh, smush is another one. You got smash and mush. Um, these are called portmanteau. Structure built from discarded K 
cans. Beeramid. Nice. Conduct could be wage. Third of Sophocles's Theban plays. Something gone. Antigone. I think it's Antigone. 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 And then wage. To conduct war, for example, is to wage war. Preventative measure is a ban. Oh, this is going to be nest egg. Usually, I guess that would be like savings that you can't touch until you're older. Direction traveled on the San Francisco-Oakland Bay Bridge. That would be east-northeast. And this is Merritt and Heim. Never heard of that band. Rock band with the 2020 Album of the Year nominee, Women in Music, Part 3. I've never heard of the band Heim. All right. Nice little puzzle. No theme, just like we suspected for a Friday. Usually Fridays and Saturdays are really tough, and they don't really need a theme. They just need to be a clean grid, as they say. All right, so now I get to pick the word of the day. Wow, I just noticed too that you have German in this one, Air. Hair is like a uh, mister. East. Das ist gut. It's also German. Here you have French and French next to each other. Um, let's see. What Am I missing anything? Well, for the word of the day, I think it's going to be Occam. Occam's razor. I already touched on it, but if you're unfamiliar with that, that Occam's razor is the thing that says the most simplest explanation is usually the correct one. And the only challenge with that is being able to distinguish what is the most logical explanation and uh, what isn't. And sometimes propaganda would have us believe that one thing is so obvious, even though when you step back and reanalyze, it might be that the most obvious thing is that the news and the uh, whatever is lying to you. So you got to always consider that. O C C A M Occam. I don't remember who came up with that. I mean, I'm sure his name was Occam, but I don't know when or where from or what have you so occam's razor all right thanks for watching hope you enjoyed this puzzle and uh if you liked it give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel i'm gonna keep making more of these so i hope that you like it and if you know anybody who's into crossword puzzles and maybe isn't good enough to actually solve the weekend puzzles which, let's face it, most of us aren't. Uh, I hope that you direct them to my channel and they can learn. <laughs>